Welcome everyone back to the journeyman uh, today I am gonna react to a new trailer uh, it might be a new trailer this might be fake or even a TV spot considering um, some of these trailers I'm seeing down the side bit here um, but I have seen some official real trailers on rapid trailer more than likely at 1 minute 34 this could be a TV spot looped got no idea but I thought you know I haven't seen this trailer yet uh, Godzilla in Rome um, and yeah see see what's going on and you know I enjoyed the the MonsterVerse movies so far really like Godzilla 2014 it's not as good as Godzilla 98 um, but what you're gonna do uh, King of the Monsters is cool um, Godzilla vs Kong is cool Skull Island's cool um, is there any others Monarch, the Monarch, Monarch, the series. I enjoyed the first episode. Um, it was interesting, um, but I think they blew their budget um, all on that first episode, and you know everything after that. I, I mean, the the historical stuff, you know, like the fifties, sixties stuff. I think was is the most interesting element of that show. Um, you know, unfortunately, I think the characters, like the modern day characters or the 2015 characters, are just a bit bland. Um, you know, I find it hard to believe during the events of like Godzilla 14 and King of the Monsters, in between all of what's going on, that these these dopey characters are just um, rolling around with Monarch, uh, Monarch, Monarch, Monarch. Um, yeah, and you know, it just feels like, um, you know, I think the production value nosedive on the episodes following um, the first episode and you know and a lot of the, the effects look quite cheap and you know it's it's you know I'm a big fan of sliders if you ever see that show and that's just like crummy sci-fi TV like 90s late 90s to the maximum but you know I know what sliders is is it's not monsterverse you know it's you know it's down here and MonsterVerse should be like up here in terms of quality, production, you know, care and all that that's put into it. And it's it's just not that, you know. It feels to me like MonsterVerse is down there with your sliders and your Stargate TV shows and um man, what was that fucking T V show from the nineties? Um they were, you know, um Space Precinct. <laughs> it was that's what Monarch feels like. If you haven't seen it, it was just, you know, that's what it feels like to me, that type of quality um, from episode two onwards. So, yeah, look it up if you haven't seen it. But, okay, so, you know, I think you've heard me waffle on for long enough now. Um, so we'll dive into it. Uh, from the looks of this movie, the trailers and things so far, um, you know, Godzilla and King Kong are buddies now. Um, Godzilla rallied up the troops at the end of King of the Monsters, or they were just respected him, or something like that. I'm not too down with the the canon and the lore of um, the MonsterVerse, um, as I am with such other franchises and that. I just I just like to you know turn my brain off and, and watch them. So you know, I think there's like a new threat now, which is um, I don't know. A, a, relative or a descendant of Kong uh, who lives in the underworld um, you know didn't this happen in like uh, the newish Planet of the Apes um, movies or the newish ones that you know the last series of them you know humans versus apes and then you know I think didn't the apes and humans buddy up to kill you know the, the bad ape the one with the scar face um, I don't know Tell me if I'm right, tell me if I'm wrong, who knows, who cares. Um, so let's go, let's play this. Uh, I just played a few seconds to skip the the nonsense. So let's see if this is a, a real trailer, or is it a TV spot or whatnot. But yeah, let's go, let's see what's going on. It's already feeling like a TV spot. Okay, looks like a, um, like a Japanese or something trailer. Yeah, this is the underworld. On the surface of our planet. Is this the Matrix? Transformers? It is Transformers. Avenger the Fallen. 
Oh, no, it's King Kong again. This world has more secrets. Got that neon pink. Yeah, there's Kong's brother, cousin, something or another. Mr. Anderson. Oh, that's cool, though. That's a cool shot though. Yeah, so it was a, a TV spot by the looks of it. A lot of the other, or a lot of the shots on it were, yeah, pretty much standard TV spot trailers. 99% of the shots or 95% of the shots are from the first trailer or the second trailer, what, what is out at that point, And then they'll drop a couple of new shots in like, um, yeah, what looked like the Godzilla and the uh, the Colosseum. Um, yeah, I'll watch it. Uh, you know, why not? It's it's gonna be fun. You know, I'll pay my ten quid to go and watch it at the cinema. <laughs> if only cinema tickets were ten quid anymore. But yeah, um, yeah, yeah. But there, it's, it's, again, you know, this is what I say. I don't want to shit on Monarch too much, but. It doesn't have that grand feeling, even when it does, then wide shots and things like that. And Godzilla um, comes out and, and the other monsters, it did in the first episode, but just not in the second episode. On, and onwards, it, it just didn't have that big grand feeling about it. Um, the, the best way as well that I can describe it, as aside from the other ways that I described it, is you watch Aladdin... The first one, it's big. It's cinem uh, the Disney cartoon. It's big. It's cinematic. It's you know, it's awesome. And then you watch Return of Jafar, the the straight to video sequel after that. It's very flat. It it feels very shallow and it feels very small. Um, and that's what I get from Monarch after ser uh, episode two, which you know, yeah, it is a TV show, but there are other TV shows with the same if not less budget that achieved that and and that's a real shame so you know a, a, a good one actually that i was talking to a, a friend about yesterday i was recommending watching um invasion that's also on apple tv again that show has like a big grand feel to it and that's on apple tv as well i mean season season two uh, i'm struggling with just because it just yeah, you know, I waited two years for it and it seems to suck so far. I could be wrong, I need to go back to it. Um, but yeah, it's again that's that's the way I feel about it and um hopefully that'll change. Um yeah, maybe I think there's one more episode of Monarch to watch, so I'll watch that. I'm watching Servant at the moment though, that's a fucking awesome show. That's on Apple T V. But yeah, uh thanks for watching. What a surprise my phone's ringing whenever I'm recording, as it always does. But yeah. Like and subscribe. Um, I'm going to try and put more regular content out as per my last video. I've got my little nerd room fixed in the new house we bought. Uh, I fixed my PC. Um, I've got some new stuff to upgrade it as well, but I fixed it to the point where it actually works and works good now. So there's no rush for me to, you know, do all the other shit to it. So it works as good as it works now. So yeah, thanks for watching. Um, yeah, let me know what you think about Godzilla X Kong. And Kong, first Kong, with Kong, uh, below. Cheers.